Question. In this society, it's difficult to raise boys, especially teenagers. Uh, I, I would add to that girls as well, but the question I say is boys. Um, how can we support them without compromising our religion? The Sheikh, he began by mentioning the ayah in which Allah Azza wa Jal says, the translation of which is, save yourselves and a fire, save yourselves and your family from a fire whose fuel is men and stones. So the Sheikh brought this to show the importance of how we raise our children and how we raise our, uh, here in the question, we're talking about how we raise our boys, how we raise this, our sons, to, that it should be from the Quran and the Sunnah. And then the Sheikh, he said, we have to establish the right environment generally. So the Sheikh went on to explain by what he means by the right environment. So he said, for example, having an Islamic school that the children go to is part of the right environment. Having good friends and companions that they play with together is part of having a good environment. And the Sheikh mentioned a, a famous proverb that the one who doesn't have something can't give it. So if the parents in the first place are not people or are people who are weak, who are not practicing properly, they're not going to be able to give their children the ability or to instill in their children the ability to practice their religion properly. So the Sheikh said, we hope that they are scholars, but even if they're not scholars, at least to have that basic knowledge of the Quran, the Sunnah, the Athar, the things of the Sahaba and the Salaf that they said. And Sheikh said, even, so he said, if there is a weakness in the parents practicing of Islam, or there's a weakness in the environment they've set up. Sheikh said, even in the entertainment and the games that those children play, choosing the right toys for your children. He said, it's all about making good choices. And the Sheikh even mentioned choosing the times in which you allow them to do certain things, like the times in which you allow them to play. So the Sheikh said, it's about husn al ikhtiyar, it's about making good choices. Uh, choices for your children and he again emphasized the environment making a comprehensive and complete environment in which those children can be nurtured and the sheikh did mention at the beginning that it is a big uh, topic